Now, I know we didn't vote for this in the community polls. However, I think there's a lot of interest for slime content. People are coming out even saying stuff like, bro, slime diaries better than season three so far, which is a pretty bold take. But I haven't seen slime diaries and I should have seen it earlier. But while, you know, we have this little bit of a break during, you know, you know, transition to a new season and slime is too core. And while the trend is still hot, let's check out all the slime diaries. なんということもない。普通の人生。お、送るはずだったが、気づいたら異世界に転生して仲間ができて、街を作って、俺はスライムとして平和に日光浴をしている。オッケー。イッツイズダイリーズ。俺のこれまでを。いや、the yeah, art style is totally Gazelle. <laughs> that was a cool move. Yo, that was Gazelle's like duel with Rimuru, right? Thunder of heaven and earth. It was like a two pronged attack from above and below. <laughs> Honestly, that, that technique is actually spoiling so much. Why would you ever say a name technique where it hints at what the direction of the attack is going to be? Like, Heaven and Earth, it sounds like it's gonna be a two-piece attack, you know, top-bottom, you know? Like, I feel like you should never say that when you're about to use that move, and the opponents won't be like, Oh, shit. Now I don't know which way you're gonna hit me. She looks very different, too. End? Whoa, whoa. Are we done? Okay, we're done. I think he actually reminds me of Gobji from Remonster. And that's Haruka. Haruka's... We haven't seen Haruka today in the most recent slime episode, but... Prominent goblins. Yeah, everyone's designs are different, huh? The orcs gotta always suffer through this shit. <laughs> and Benny looks so different. Hakuro? What the fuck? You tell me that's Hakuro? <laughs> what is that poo stash? What the fu- <laughs> Manga accurate Hakuro? No. You see it? That's what he actually looked like? <laughs> also, Go Gopta just sneaking out in the, uh, on the edges, but damn. Looking Hakuro like that, he, he looks so different. This look, this this feels weird to me. I feel like, oh, uh, I, uh, I don't know. <laughs> Those eyes are definitely Holy shit, they have a lot of fucking free time on their hands. That's what they were fucking arguing about, which... Uh, <laughs> we're gonna put Rimuru in a lot of fancy-ass dresses, huh? Let's get a... Let's, let's, hold up. Hmm. Hmm. Option one or two? Hmm. I might go with two. The blue does color match, but the Seifuku outfit is pretty OP. Hmm. Both is pretty good. Let's try them on, everybody. <laughs> it, it is very important to them. He's actually putting them on. Oh, never mind. Okay. Where's Diablo, man? We need fucking Diablo right now. We don't have him though, plot wise, timeline wise. Oh. And this is before she won got the gift Master Chef or something, where even if her cooking looks like shit, it tastes good. So this is just like a poison vat. Perfect. How? 
<laughs> he only likes Shion because she's got big ass titties and he's always wanted like a secretary accountant girl, you know, in a big ass titty business suit. You are Opai, Shion. You are simply Opai. Yes, she does. いいのさ。ま、行ってくる。なんだよ、総大将自ら見回りか。おい、すいません。ごめんなさい。この街と。いいケメン。ヒスト <laughs> They all thirst over Betty like that. <laughs> Enjoy. Did they adore him? Gopta's gang. Big man Gopta, baby. <laughs> Boy, she's out of your league. I'm sorry, kids. <laughs> she is out of your league. I don't know. But it wouldn't be funny if this is Gopta's girl. Damn! Who is that? Her hair perfectly fluttering the wind. Let's make a move. Hey! Oh, Gopta! Oh, group leader. So why? Nah, we're getting set up. We're getting set up. Nah, we're getting set up. That's a handprint on his face. He tried to hit on her. She slapped his ass. Yep. He tried that shit. Again, Scarlet Bond. And this is the only time they paid his goddamn voice actor because he ain't fucking talking in the main story. Rimuru okay. likes Kurobe because he seems like a middle-aged man, just like a normal guy, right? That reminds him of himself. Kurobe backstory? I know you can, bro. He's actually pretty epic right now. Holy shit, he's still getting screen time. I think this is Haruka. How sharp is it? The entire table got cut? Kurobe, bro. Kurobe fucking... You, you remember the Demon Slayer Swordsmith Village arc? Where fucking the, the guy in the jar is fucking attacking, right? And, and then bro is just like, I don't care. I'm still fucking doing this shit. That's the level of fucking dedication that's been put into this knife. Zoe? <laughs> okay. Zoe's girl at? Yeah? Who <laughs> Girl, I'm sorry. Like, you already got power crit. Well, maybe it's gonna be like a three-way triangle. Actually, it's not even a fucking triangle because Soy, I don't think, gives a fuck about, you know, you know, fucking the sister and the church blonde girl, right? They're both chasing after Soy, but I don't think Soy gives a fuck. <laughs> He's a softy at heart. <gasps> oh! Soy likes cats! Nia, say Nia. Say Nia. What the fuck was that? He's like, gotcha, motherfucker. You thought I was being cute? You already dead. <laughs> and uh, she loves it. Oh god, he's hot. Oh god, he's hot. I don't, I don't think Vesta's in here right now, right? No. Gabiru? No! That's a They're like doing farm work in here? 
What are they doing? Trying to farm work in a cave? What the fuck? Hold on, Gabiru's about to say something. Let him finish the fucking thing. What's Gabiru gonna finish with? <laughs> what are these idiots fucking doing right now? Are we like practicing for an audition? <laughs> they are literally rehearsing. Brooke does not want any of this. <laughs> ところで深刻角の建設状況ってどうだっけ？ボイズどうしよう。え、そんな。この調子で嘘を言うより頑張るかな。おっと。ロングオンでシャドウス。あまりでバンがないから、そんな時でもこの影が。こっちどうなんや
guild? Kurobe? These poor slaves, man. <laughs> okay, we got some goblins helping out. だからさ、働きそうよ。いや、ゆがらにハーブスキルって。リムル様のためにも。ボブギャルドゥンイズオフタイム、アイワンダー。まあ、皆さんがそんなに自由に生きてほしいんだよ。Oh, I forget which episode it was, but was it at the one of the movies? But there was Trainee, you know, at a bar or something, and I was like, what the fuck? Trainee had a bar? And y'all were like, yeah, Slime Diaries. Bartender. Did she just quit her job as a fucking dryad that looks over the forest just to be a bartender? Because she's like, fuck that shit. My sister can do the work now. Alright. It's that thing. What is that thing? It's the second time we're seeing it today, right? It's a huge ass thingy that's just screeching in the air going, I don't know. I don't know. Are we gonna interact with it? Mm. Everyone comes out in the morning this early for him? It's like 5 in the morning, everyone's ready. Oh! No! Don't make me go in there! Please stop! Celebration? 500 day anniversary, boys! Every one's gonna be it's gonna be a celebration every fucking episode if we're gonna, if we're gonna keep it this way. How the fuck is everyone here already mobilized at five in the morning? Let's just party. Party time! Is Vesta not supposed to be here? I thought Vesta. When was Vesta dropped off to work in the cave with the potions and stuff, and, and Gabir was there too? I swear to God, Vesta should be here time wise. Is he not? I guess he's not here yet. <laughs> that is Slime Diaries Episode 1. And you know what? <laughs> Even though it felt like nothing happened, and that is kind of the point, right? You're not supposed to expect grandiose plot points. You're supposed to experience the day-to-day -day life of different characters and what they're up to. It's kind of cool to see every character just kind of chill, just hang out. What do they do in their daily lives? What does Benny Mata do? What kind of house does Benny Mata live in? Oh, this is what Kurobe is like. Kurobe is getting so many different lines, you know? Soe and them, they, you know, Soe is not girlfriend, but Gabriel's sister thirsting over Soe, getting more development from side supporting characters. And one of the things that I really like about, you know, uh, good shows is side characters. I actually love these side characters, the beings that I call NPCs all the time. Sometimes they are the peak entertainment for me. Like, if you, imagine, yo, imagine Classroom of the Elite, but Slime Diaries method. Hondo would have an entire fucking scene, bro. All these other NPCs, bro. Holy shit. That would be actually peak fucking content where it's just cunny episodes like the pool episodes. Remember Ryuan kicking down a fucking wet, wet you know, floor slide saying, hmm, I go wherever I want. You know, it, it, it has this kind of vibes, right? Like, it's stupid ass, funny moments, developing different side characters that you don't get to interact more with. But overall, this is pretty good. And I'm gonna, I think I'm gonna enjoy the rest of the season too. And that's it for me. Uh, one thing though, Hakuro without the fucking mustache. How could it with the mustache? Something about that's kind of weird, man. But that's it from me. If you're still here, if you didn't enjoy this reaction, please like the video. Check out the other playlists for more content. And until next time, take care.